My braids came out. I was asleep. I ain't been on this channel in a minute. I need me a haircut. I have not been on YouTube in a minute. Let's make a deal. Bitch, be for real. Is you off a pill? Okay. Let's make a deal. Rumpel still skin. She wanna see my purple pickle up in the wind. Okay. Sean cut that's off, bitch. Get in. And if your nigga don't like me, hit any chin chin. Bitch, I'm hotter than a pepper, no mint. <laughs> Big stepper, no still. Big Hey man, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Clark Palo, aka YKP, whatever you guys wanna call me, and I'm back with another banger YouTube video. If you guys can't read, go back to school, but if you guys can read, you'll see the title of today's video. Today, first off, let me point this out. What, what shirt am I wearing? I know y'all are like, damn Clark, that, that shirt fire. That shirt, that bitch fire. You know what I'm saying? That's that splat. This, that splat. That's that splat. Y'all can see it on the back. You know what I'm saying? You got the YKP on the back. I don't know if I did that enough. You can see the YKP on the back. You see that? YKP, see the YKP up here, it is my merch, and I wanna let you guys know something uh, of my past few videos, and a lot of my videos with most views. I make no money off YouTube, basically, realistically. Like, you guys think I make a lot of money on YouTube, and I have, like, nice things and stuff like that? I, I have to get a job now, because this YouTube shit is not paying me at all, so I would really, really appreciate it if you guys went down below and cop some merch, and I know I'm plugging at the beginning of the video, but I have to get it out there. I am not making money on YouTube, and right now, I've never done anything for money, but right now I'm trying to stack up for, like, something big. Money is kind of like a necessity right now, you know what I'm saying? So I'm not going to change my content for money, but I am going to ask you guys, if you guys want to support the channel, please help me out by copying some merch, even just copying some stickers or like five bucks. So if you guys could do that, that would really help out a lot because you know what I'm saying? Right now money is a, a big thing that I need, but I will not change my content in order to make money. You know what I'm saying? I won't start making pussy videos and stop fucking cursing my goddamn fucking videos just so I can get money. But I am asking you guys to support me on the outside. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Anyway, if you guys can't read, go back to school, but if you guys can read, you're still tired today's video. Today, I'm back with another little story time. Like, yeah, like a little story time and a reaction at the same time today. You guys, that fucking voice crack, you guys see it. You know what I'm saying? I, I tried to film this video before on my Instagram, Clark underscore Paolo, on live, and I actually filmed the whole video and I got the whole thing corrupted. So, and I, but the thing is, I only looked at a few love letters. Um, oh, yeah, I fucking forgot to say that. We're reacting to love letters that I had written to me when I was younger, like sixth grade. Um, and my, yeah, yeah, so I tried, I tried filming this and it got corrupted, so I'm refilming it. I only looked at like a few letters, so my reaction is gonna be pure again. But the thing is, is that, uh, I tried contacting my ex-girlfriend, uh, like the girl that made me the, not my ex-girlfriend, just this little fucking girl I fucked with. She was not my ex-girlfriend. Never will be call, qualified as my girlfriend. But the one that wrote me all these, and I asked her, like, to basically, like, if I could call her and put her in the video, that bitch was mad. She was, she said she hates me and I'm disgusting and I should be a sh I don't know why. She hasn't given me a reason. I didn't care to ask her. But, uh, yeah, so if you guys were going to be like, hey, you should have put it in the video, that's why I can't. I, I don't know if I'll show the messages because I don't, they're too far in my DMs and I don't fucking care. Um, but if you're watching this, I, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's get into this. These are all the, the love letters this girl wrote me. Do you guys see this? Do you guys see this? These are all the love letters this girl wrote me, you guys. Look at it. Oh my god, there is so many. There's still more in the thing. There's still more in there. But we're just gonna be reacting and reading these. Um, some of these, not all of them, of course. Let me give you a little backstory, though. This girl and I dated in like sixth grade, but like for like two years or something like that, like a year and like six months, something like that. Like we did it for how long? And the bitch cheated on me hella time. We, we did it in the middle school, too. And she cheated on me hella times. Um, and yeah, it was it was pretty it was pretty crazy. Like you guys can see this. I don't even know. Should I put her name in it? I can't really get in trouble for it because she wrote me these. I won't put them in it because fuck her. But you guys can see she wrote me a little one year thing with the panda bear because that used to be our little inside joke. Uh, so you probably seen her name. I don't care, but fuck her. I don't care. Um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna read some of these. So this girl is pretty crazy about me. Oh, pretty crazy. This one says 12, 14, 15. So December 14, 2015 at 10 47 p.m. Quote unquote, I never planned to love you, but I'm happy I did. You and me forever, please. I am amazed when I look at you, not just because I, not just because of your looks, but because of the fact that everything, you're, that everything I ever wanted is right in front of me. True as fuck. Honestly, Paolo, you make me happy. She forgot to put the Y. That's sixth grade spelling for you. 
Her handwriting was pretty good though for a sixth grader. And you make me cry. Damn, bitch. But I know that I wouldn't give any of our love up for anything because I knew in the other end we have each other. This, my sky will always be bright and never gray as long as you stay good and God, I love you so as much. The fucking dinginess of some of these papers. 119 AM, titled, Baby, capital, okay. I just wanted to let you know that I will, I'll wear the necklaces you gave me like every day of my life. That's a promise. Bitch, you better be wearing them fucking necklaces right the fuck now. You better be watching this fucking video like, damn, this nigga is hell smart. He got me wearing these fucking necklaces. God fucking damn it. Like every day of my life, that's a promise. And as well as the bracelet, LOL. Okay, you just wanted to, yeah, just wanted to let you know. Heart, 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 heart. From, I'm not gonna say, to be honest, I love calling you Bible. This is fucking sick. This is disgusting. This, this is a girl who gave me trust issues. This is my first girlfriend, and she gave me fucking trust. Did you see that? She fucking promised. And uh, it's 2020, and the bitch is not wearing it. Five years, you should still be wearing a fucking bracelet, bitch. I'm not, I'm not playing with you, bitch. Next one. P.S. I'm writing this at one in the morning. So, hi, lol, I.K. I know I wrote a lot of letters. Okay. But blank is fun as fu- Oh, this is when she was at the- this is a, uh, a field trip to a, it's a slide park. Fucking voice, are my balls dropping or something? What the fuck? This was when, when she went on a, a, a fucking field trip to Sly Park. Okay, but Sly Park is fun as, uh, fun as fuck the first night. The first night is loud as fuck. The second night, okay and cool. The third night, getting used to shit. Fourth night, tired and wanna go home. Friday, going home. Lol, I can't wait for you to come back home and hug and kiss you and love you, lol. But yep, you make me happy, so be happy knowing me I'm happy. I think about our future to be happy, lol. Okay, I love you more, ha 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 ha. You can't say anything. Yay, I finally won your baby. Oh my god, this one is fresh. This one is a fresh letter. Fresh letter. That I've never opened. Do you see that fucking? Do you see the folding? The quality? First off, look at the quality of my fucking camera. Can we just point that out? Like, goddamn, I love my camera. Anyway, do you see this? Okay, yeah, let's open this up. I won't do all of them today. Uh, like, I won't. I won't look at. Like, I'll do like three more. Or something like that. I'm gonna. I'll make this a two part. If this video does good, if you guys can get this to like three thousand likes, I'll do a part two. But because there are certain ones in here that I I didn't look at, but I know have shit in them because like I was told, you know what I'm saying? And I remember these like, and there's a whole box of other shit that I okay, just just these are the last ones, okay? So if you guys want a part two, like the fucking video and comment down below. I want a part two. This one says 10:59 p.m. December 17, 2015. Paolo, I love the way you. Let me read it like a girl. Paolo. I love the way you hug me, and I love how you always soft kissable lips, and when you worry if you don't, I love the way you grab my face and kiss me, I love the way you respect my decisions, I, why am I sounding like a Latina bitch? I love the way you look into my eyes, I love the way you stole my heart, I love our love story, it was so toxic, this bitch was crazy, and she cheated on me like a hundred times, and she got her nudes leaked, I remember, not like that was cool. That's child pornography, but I remember that happened because she cheated on me, and I was like, damn. I love our, oh, I already read that. I love our love, I, I love the weird, our weirdness, weird, weedness. She didn't say weird. She said, I love our weedness and our crazinessness. She put two S's, says this. I love our phone convos. I love our idea of our future. I love the thought of quote unquote us. I love the thought of Netflix and cuddles. I love the thought of laying on your chest one day. I love the thought dot, dot, dot. Of being you and having a life with you, Paolo. You're my first love and I would love you to be my last. I will always stay by your side and try to help you with anything as long as you got me. I love you so. Bitch, you lied to me talking about you love me from the start. Bitch, you lied to me talking about you never break my heart. Bitch, you lied to me talking about a damn love. Well, baby, girl, it wasn't love. Guess I got was in enough. Bitch, lie to me. What the fuck? Where you at? You by my side. Where you at? Only thing I keep by my side is a stick. The fuck? The fuck out of here. Bitch, lie to me. <laughs> that shit is so fucking gay. Bro, she wrote to me like it was like text conversations. Oh, this one's raw. She put like, she drew flowers and shit. Do you see that? Can you see that? She drew like flowers and shit all along the sides. What the fuck? Oh, she typed this one up. Love is waking up, oh, sorry, blank, blank, 6.22 p.m., 11.12.
Love is waking up in the morning with someone special. Love is that sparkle in your eyes when you see that person you love. Love is staying up late because you're worried about that someone or staying up late crying because you feel like you fucked up with them. No bitch, that's called being toxic. Love is wanting them, wanting to be with someone so bad that it hurts and just wanting to cuddle and love them and kiss them. The fact, that is how she defined love. Love is wanting to be with someone so bad it hurt me and I cuddle and kiss you. What? Bitch! Love is trying to be perfect even though you know you're gonna fuck up. No, that's called being toxic. <laughs> Why would you try it if you know you're gonna fuck <laughs> Love is wanting to stay in their arms for as long as you feel like it. Love makes you do crazy things. Yeah, we know, bitch. And say crazy things. Love is like the crazy shit you wrote in this letter. Love is what me and you have, baby. No, baby. What we had was toxic bullshit. <laughs> I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to say I love you to anyone else. The bitch she told me said by saying I love you to six other niggas. Even thinking about li that literally makes me feel like crying. Well, it, you did cry when I left you. I wouldn't want to hug anyone else or kiss him. No, well, you did. Uh, I think you fucked him, actually. I only want you and I hope that we can stay like this for a long time. I don't know how you feel, but I know how I do. And I know that I don't feel the same without you from when I don't get kisses goodbye or have when you first time by my side. Baby, I have never felt like anyone with this before. And I don't feel like this is anyone for I love you. I will always love you even if you ever broke my heart. Even if you did the worst to me, I still love you because I'm a crazy fucking bitch. Baby, even if it's been crazy with you, I'm so happy I can say happy one year later if you were with me, then you hugged someone else than I did in the process. But damn, fuck them, because I love being in your arms and kissing them lips so much. I love you with my heart, Paolo, and I don't know what I would do without you. Love, stupid bitch. Next letter. This is opened. I don't know what to title this, lol. That one, I, I already took the letter off. I don't know which, how these fucking go in order. Oh, I should probably put, I think this one. This is funny. I want to show my kids this shit when I'm older and like just be like, look guys, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. Like these relationships right now. Well, if you're under the age of 25, your relationships don't matter unless you stay together. This shit is, but I will say I'm very happy I went through this because it did teach me a lot about women or at least females. Not women though. 1.13 a.m. You have the pieces of my heart. You're my half. You're my everything. This bitch had the fucking audacity to use the word your one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven times. Talking about me, you are, and had the audacity to put your, your, bitch, it's you are, it's Y-O-U-R, it's apostrophe R-E, or however you spell the bitch. You're my half. You're my everything. Yeah, how am I your half, but then I'm your You stupid fuck. You bitch, you lying. You stupid. You're my life. Well, that's just not true. You're why I'm alive. That is true. The bitch did try killing herself, and I, I do use the term the bitch a lot. Um, that's just because I don't want to admit. I don't like the girl. I don't call females bitches. I don't like the girl. So, but when I am talking about the suicide stuff, you guys know I take that shit really serious as someone who has um, whatever you feel me and been seen, you know what I'm saying, whatever. I did help the girl, at least to my knowledge, not kill herself, which was pretty, like, at least she got a positive out of the relationship, I guess. Because she was gonna, she used to, yeah, cut her wrist and all that shit, so. Happy I helped. You're why I woke up in the morning. You're who I want to be with. You're my one and only. Every time I yell, it's because it's capital. You have my heart. You are the cutest. You are the weirdest. You are the funniest, gesture. You are the funnierest. F-U-N-N-I-E-R-S-T. You are the funnierest. You are my baby. You one. You are my baby, and I love you. Purple heart. Purple heart was like a thing that we had. Oh, is this shit on that? Oh no. Last two. Oh no, last one. Last one, y'all. Last fucking one. We still got hella. So if y'all want a part two, y'all better say it. This shit is dirty as a bitch. Bitch is dirty as fuck. I've had that soccer bear thing since I was little kid. So. You can have it. My dad gave it to me because he was in love with soccer and wanted me to be in love with it too. But I'm up in love with you, so you can have it. But yep, okay, I will love you until marriage. Yeah, I, my, my dead grandma that I lived with for my whole life gave me this ring. And not only is it worth 50 grand, but she, and it was also everyone and every female in my family had it. But you like jewelry, and I like you. So since you like jewelry, you can have it. Even if we break up and don't get married. You can have it. What? This bitch is crazy. I got hell of shit.
I gotta have a sip. Part two. If you guys want the part two, you know what I'm saying? Let me know. If you want the part two, comment down below. If you guys want the part two, make sure you guys give this 3,000 likes. I'm not fucking playing with YouTube anymore. I'm done with being shadow banned on YouTube. This shit is bullshit. Um, anyway, if you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up, drop a like, comment, and subscribe to come kick with the cookies like Clark. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I appreciate you guys so much. We're on the road to 200K, which is crazy because we're already at 110K almost. But again, like I said, money I'm not getting from YouTube. The ads go straight to YouTube or they go to the people that monetize my videos. So if you guys can help me, it would mean a lot. I got my merch. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.